My ungrateful aunt called me a gold digger for throwing away my purity ring and marrying a rich man so I cut her off financially. Last week, our daughter turned 10 and Miff 32 husband 56 and I decided not to have a party because I had a baby just two weeks ago and we don't want anyone around for now. Our daughter understood and was more than happy to celebrate with just her parents and siblings. But we wanted her to be able to celebrate with her friends so he took her to a restaurant with all her friends and then shopping. When my family found out about it they got furious because they say that we exclude them. The first to call when she saw the photos I posted was my mother and although she was hurt, she understood why we decided to do that, but then my aunt called me and said horrible things to me. She is, or was, like my second mother and I know she was hurt by not being able to celebrate the birthday of my daughter, whom she loves very much, but her reaction was inexcusable. She told me that I was becoming what she always hated, that I let money change me and that now I leave my family aside because they don't have money, and that she was disappointed that I let my daughter celebrate with rich brats and not with her family. That is not true because if they had insisted on celebrating with her somewhere I would have let her too. I told her that if she wanted to celebrate with my daughter she just had to say so and I would let her go to her house so they could spend the day together, but she just said that she's no one's second option, that she's poor but that she still has dignity, not like me, who as a teenager threw away her purity ring to sleep with a rich old man so he could pay her college tuition. And here let me clarify something, yes, I was 19 when I started getting sexually involved with my husband, but it wasn't for money, because at that time I was working at his house and I earned enough to pay for my studies. It was something that happened. Out of attraction and you can't handle that regardless of whether the person has money or not. And yes, I threw away the purity ring that she gave me because I no longer wanted to continue living the way she and my family wanted. I thought, and still think, that giving a child a purity ring and making her promise to be a virgin until marriage is very sexist and there is no way I would support that now. I told her to stop talking about my husband's money because I have had a well-paying job for years and I have my own money, and all she said was something like I wouldn't have that money or that job today if I hadn't spent the last 13 years sucking some rich old man's pee pee. When she said that I had enough and told her that if she hated my or my husband's money so much then there was no point in continuing to help her financially. And I said that because about four months ago she lost her job and I'm the one who has been paying the rent for the place she lives since then. I hung up the call and I have not answered any of her calls nor have I read all the messages she sent me. I have worked so hard for what I have today and yes, Perhaps I had a little financial help from my husband, but that didn't help me graduate with honors from college, that was my merit and no one else's, and I'm not going to let anyone, not even my family, make me believe that this is thanks to my husband.